Fire. Flint. Language. Machines. In the face of crises, humanity adapted. We became warriors. Explorers. Builders. Dreamers flying forward. In control of a changing world. I'm old enough to remember what that world used to be like. We had places we belonged. Country, community, family. have ravaged 50% of global shipping ports, threatening food supply chains. The population continues to riot in the streets. Still fortify their borders. At what point does a country stop being a country? One failed state became a dozen, and now there's millions of refugees headed every direction. Except home. 1.2 billion people have been displaced by this shock. We call ourselves no pads, the non-patriated, stateless warriors fighting for our survival. The world's non-patriated fighting sides between Russia and the United States. In their Caught between the last two superpowers as they circle each other, fighting for resources, threatening to draw us into a new kind of war. satellite from falling into Russian hands. And the intel on board is all the excuse either side needs to send us straight to hell. But we faced crises before. The notepads were born out of it. We are the warriors. We are the adaptation. And this fight is ours. The firestorms began in central London. This is clearly the greatest refugee crisis in human The Dell satellites have caused a global blackout of communications and navigation systems. Both Russia and the US claim the other is responsible for the Russia are both being accused of fielding armed no-pets. No-pets, as these non-patriated call themselves, have become one of the world's largest factions, fighting not for country, but for survival.
the no pets pay you to fuck over your own country. My loyalty is with the refugees on this boat. That includes you now. Irish, all this men are 20 clicks out. I think you better take a look at something. Listen, if you give Oz that case, then that fucking terrorist will start World War III. That's what they always say, Pac. Believe that shit if you want to. But I know what I'm fighting for. Always, big man. Hey, I got something for you. Who's that? Nobody. Head back downstairs now. Put that back, Ra. We don't get paid to interfere. I know, but this is too big to ignore. America's got an experimental weapon that's about to fall out of the sky at these coordinates in 36 hours. They're desperate to recover their dirty little secret. If Russia gets it first, it could spark a war. Fuck. We can't let that maniac get his hands on the coordinates. Pukowski was right. Oz's men will be here any second. He will stop at nothing to get what he wants. We have civilians on board. We don't have enough manpower. I don't think we have a choice. Head straight into that storm. That's a Category 5, sir. Nah. That's home field advantage. Shit. I think they sense the deal's off. You have the car and roll. Oz ain't taking this boat. Irish, this storm is gonna kill us! This storm's a fucking Calvary!
so will I. Only one way to stop this war. That's to get in the middle of it. Put a call out to any notepad who will listen. 36 hours to door. Get ready to fight! <laughs> 